Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how you can view a child's year-to-date CCS absences. You can view this on the child's bookings tab so by going to the child's details page and clicking on the bookings tab you will see the year-to-date absences. Now please note year-to-date absences are recorded for the child across all services linked to CCS. This only includes a confirmed CCS enrolment. So therefore CCS absences are not recorded if the child's enrolment is in a received status, unsubmitted or an RA enrolment. You can also view this on the CAS report, so the customer account statement. It will show your year-to-date absences and it will also record the absences within the period of the statement. You can also locate the absences on the bookings report. So the bookings report is located under the reports menu and under family and you can click on bookings. When using the bookings report, you need to ensure that you select the absence in the drop down box for the attribute and it will show you the absences within the date range period for that child and also the year to date absences for that financial year. And you can also view this in the CCS entitlement variation report. So this report is found under the reports menu and under CCS and you'll find CCS entitlement variation. This report will record each time the absent count changes. So you can see it goes up and each date the time is stamped. This will follow on from the absent notification on your Kidsoft Information Centre homepage. And this also maps from the entitlement tab on the child's enrolment. So if we were to go to the child's enrolment, click on the history in the action column, and then click on the entitlement history, you will see the absent count, which matches the entitlement variation report. To upload any evidence for an absent for a child, they must have reached their 42 absent days. So this means by coming over to the child's details page and clicking on the bookings tab, you can then click on that absent document tab. By uploading these documents, CCS will then be paid. However, it will not include and make any count towards the 42 unexplained days. For any further information on absences, the 42 days or the reports, please do not hesitate to reach out to the Kidsoft customer success team. You may also like to look at our additional video tutorials in our YouTube channel for more tips on Kidsoft. Thank you.